though, we always want to check on you. Wednesday, August, I always want to say October. August, please, 29th. I'm Robin Mead. Okay, if your state didn't vote last night, it still stands to impact you in this way. The results say analysts may be a big road sign about where both parties are headed this year. First up, Florida. Florida is going to be running for the Senate and easily won the GOP primary to square off against Senator Bill Nelson, and that's in November. Okay, here's another senator on the Senate floor standing right next to John McCain's old desk adorned with roses. It's so dangerous to be on the side of the road, they always say, because people look at you and just drift. That's oh. a good point. That is a very good point. Yeah. The stock market. Okay, I wanted to start this story this way. I feel good. Ba -na 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 -na. Do you feel good about the stock market? I mean, is that the reason that we feel good about the economy or is it vice versa? Anyway, partly there's a report that we do feel good about the economy and the stock market people notice. Okay. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. That was part of it. I mean, we had what? Well, All righty, morning. Um, our salute to the troops, what we do every morning, once an hour. Today, your fellow viewer, Tracy, would like to salute somebody who? Will anything get done? Blah, blah, blah. So Google says it wants to help veterans when they come back from active duty. Google. And, and Jen says that this is either by helping them get a job or helping them with their business. I love this. What a different way to say thanks for your service. Yeah. Right? It's not just saying it. Google's going to do something about it. That way. I yeah. like that. All right. Here's something else you get to do besides get all the school supplies. We're going to do it anyway. <laughs> I'm going to try and sell you. That is coming up. All right. Thank you. <laughs> I looked around for Bob. Yeah. Because for he'll me, joke Bob. every now and then, our, our meteorologist Bob Van Dillon, when, when I say, it's so hot outside, how hot is it? And he'll say, it's so hot that it makes you want to dump some ice down your short. <laughs> well, I, you caught my attention, Heinz, when you said that there was a player, it was so hot at the U.S. Open, that he talked about the ice sands the shorts. Yes, Rob, I mean, it got what? extremely yeah. hot. I know you're going to like this story, Jen. <laughs> About the U.S. Open? Yeah. Just don't try that on the subway on the way home. <laughs> <laughs> because the crowd probably felt like, that is a good solution. Yeah. <laughs> Ice baths everywhere in New York. <laughs> All right.